The phrase, backfiring, explained. Hello, dear viewers. Today, we're going to unravel the mystery behind the word, backfiring. Whether you're learning English as a second language or just brushing up on your vocabulary, understanding such phrases is key to improving your language skills. So, let's dive in and discover when and how to use the term backfiring correctly. The term backfiring originates from an automotive malfunction where an engine misfires and exhausts a loud sound. However, in everyday language, it has a metaphorical meaning. It's used to describe a situation where an action has the opposite effect from what was intended, often leading to an unexpected and undesirable outcome. For example, when someone plans a surprise party to make someone happy, but it ends up causing them embarrassment or discomfort, the surprise party could be said to have backfired. To better understand how to use backfiring, let's look at some examples in everyday conversations and scenarios. Trying to be funny, I tried to make a joke to lighten the mood, but it backfired and just made everyone uncomfortable. In policies or plans, the government implemented new taxes to increase revenue, but it backfired, causing a recession instead. In personal relationships, he bought her a gym membership to encourage her to pursue her fitness goals, but it backfired as she took it as an insult. Interestingly, the concept of backfiring is also echoed in some English proverbs and idioms, like the best laid plans of mice and men often go awry. This means even well-planned actions can result in failure or negative outcomes. Play with fire and you'll get burned. This warns that risky behavior often leads to trouble, akin to actions backfiring. That's all for today's lesson on the phrase, backfiring. We hope this explanation clears up any confusion and helps you use this term correctly in your own conversations. Remember, learning English comes with its set of challenges, but understanding these nuances can make you a proficient speaker. Until next time, keep learning and don't let any mistakes deter you. Sometimes, they can be the best teachers. Goodbye and take care.